Hello everyone, my name is Tom Ryan with WPS Provider Outreach and Education. Today we're going to hear about the importance of provider enrollment to the Medicare program. The provider enrollment area is assigned the task of making sure providers are legally eligible to receive Medicare payment. Provider enrollment's job is to screen providers to avoid fraudulent billing, ensure anyone asking for payment meets the federal law requirements, and make sure providers meet license or certification criteria. The Medicare Administrative Contractor, or MAX, enrollment staff completes enrollment for individual physicians and non-physician practitioners, suppliers, such as labs or ambulance companies, and facilities such as hospitals or skilled nursing facilities. Medicare allows enrollment two ways, electronically or on paper, and we process both applications. Internet-based Provider Enrollment Chain and Ownership System, or PCOS, completes the electronic enrollment process. This system has built-in edits to help you through the process and to ensure the application does not need development. We have a shorter time to complete the processing of electronic applications versus paper applications. Paper applications are on the CMS Form 855. There are multiple applications depending on the type of provider enrolling. Paper applications do have a section to indicate which sections to complete. However, unlike the edits, it's harder to ensure that your information is complete and accurate. Regardless of application type, be sure to send all supporting documentation. The required documentation changes based on the action you're trying to take. To learn more, view our website or one of the CMS 855 paper applications. Also, check our website to see all of the activities we complete related to provider enrollment, the status of your enrollment application, or to find contact information. Visit the CMS website for which providers are eligible to enroll in Medicare to determine if you need to pay an enrollment fee, or to link to internet-based PCOS. The links are provided in the description of this video. That's it for the introduction to provider enrollment. Check out our other videos on this subject. The best way to do that is through the three playlists, Provider Enrollment, Internet-Based PCOS, and Paper Enrollment Applications. Thanks for watching this video. If you found it helpful, like and share it. Leave us a comment and we'll respond to it. Last, subscribe to our YouTube channel for the most current information coming from us.